smoothies have been named innocent. So what are all the other beverages guilty of? <laughs> Hello, I'm Sarah. Sarah Keyworth, I'm from Nottingham. I live in a small village in Nottingham called Burton Joyce. And the thing about Burton Joyce is that, is that it's full of mature people. It's full of seasoned people. Bert and Joyce are actually the names of an elderly couple that just won't fucking die. <laughs> and the thing about these elderly people is that no matter who you are or what you look like, if you walk towards them in the street, they will get intimidated. And they will cross the road. And it's like they think that you can't cross the road. <laughs> and I find myself saying things like, no, I can get you. <laughs> The most exciting thing I've ever seen happen in Burton Joyce is an elderly woman drop a cucumber. She was forced to chase it as it rolled down the street. <laughs> no, I didn't help. In fact, I rolled several more cucumbers down after her. Just catch one, Doris. Just catch one. <laughs> and then you and I can make a sandwich. <laughs> Rhubarb prices are on the rise. A sure sign that our economy is beginning to crumble. <laughs> As a result of this, I took to growing rhubarb on the street and I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, is that legal? Well, I didn't know myself until I got taken into custody. <laughs> Get on board. <laughs> I tried to tell them it wasn't mine, but apparently they had proof. Said it was in the pudding. <laughs> I had to see a counsellor about my life. She said, you need to turn it around. I said, I just don't care at all. Is there a root to the problem? She said, not necessarily. <laughs> but don't worry, you're not alone. I said, oh, do you get a lot of people with this problem? She said, yeah, about five a day. <laughs> the other exciting thing that's happened recently in Burton Joyce is that I've come out as being gay and it's not very easy being a gay woman, it's not very easy being a lesbian because you want to be there with the other women saying, yeah, well we can do it too. Women are just as good as men. But you don't want to raise their self-esteem too much because they'll stop sleeping with you. <laughs>